Welcome back. So, so I will tell you this. This was a late night watch last night. I didn't get the I didn't get the review and on time to to review this. I did finish this. Um, I just finished this. My parents are talking. I do apologize, but I yeah. If I, if I did miss this, that's okay um, because I just finished it last night. So let's talk about the film that I watch. I took a look at Stephen Dorff, Elle Fanning, and Sofia Coppola's Somewhere. Somewhere is a movie that I feel that needs an introduction. This film is by far a masterpiece. So yeah. Somewhere is a... The, the story of Somewhere is pretty interesting. Uh, the focus on Stephen Dorff. Uh, he is a... Uh, yeah, Stephen Dorff plays actor Johnny Johnny Marco. He's an actor, but he's also sometimes a slime ball and slime ball and a pig. But basically, in the beginning of the film, he's he's with two pole dancers, and they're just dancing. The crazy thing is that, like a couple of thirds in the film, probably two thirds of the beginning of the film, we're introduced to his daughter. Uh, Cleo, who's played by Elle Fanning, the sister of actress Dakota Fanning. But, she's sort of like the, I think she's like a 16-year-old. Is she a 16-year-old or, no, 11-year-old. I thought 16, but no, 11-year-old. So, she basically, uh, she's like one of those sort of rebel. Uh, so in the middle of the film, we also get introduced to, uh, a friend of his, Played by Party Boy himself, Chris Pontius. That's my only really complaint is Chris Pontius just does not feel, does not fit in this film. Every time I think of Chris Pontius, and then I'm just thinking of Party Boy uh, from the Jackass movies. I don't feel Chris Pontius. I just feel Party Boy. So that's my only complaint. So in the middle of the film, it tracks around whatever it is. So they go into a hotel and they're out of, they go to a hotel. He's basically an actor. So he goes into the hotel and that's where the film gets very interesting because they're at the they're at the um, they're at the pool and all that. So yeah, the thing I think that makes this movie as great is the end of the film. Not gonna give away the end, but the ending is so chilling. It almost made me cry. Two thirds of the film, he's crying. So his daughter is getting sent off somewhere. It's not really giving away the film. But at the very end of the film, the very end, this is probably where I'm going to go into spoilers. So if you haven't seen this film, please stop this video. You ready? Here we go. What makes this movie, like I said again, I do apologize, my parents are talking. What makes this special is the fact he walks off that to me parks the vehicle walks off and right there I was totally speechless with this film it bro I broke down thinking I get the film the film just spoke to me and I was like Wow. That's it? Credits. He walks off. Credits. It is that good. So, yeah. So final so my final verdict is that you need to see somewhere. Like I said, if you have not seen this film, see this movie. I watched the last couple years. It is one of the best films that I have watched. The movie came out around 2010, but it is really, really good. Like I said, check this film out. If you are interested, see this film. I paid a dollar for a Dollar Tree, and I gotta easily say, well worth a dollar. It only has one bonus feature, and that's Making Somewhere, and that's about it. So yeah, Sofia Coppola just nailed a park. Another great film from... Focus features under their Spotlight series lineup of films. It is so good. It's not for everyone. But if you get around seeing this, see this film. 
This is the movie that the Bo Fleet should have at least got the Oscar nomination. This movie should have got an Oscar for at least Best Actor or Best Actress because I haven't watched the film that was that good. I had to bring up spoilers. I didn't want to, but that was the only reason why I had to talk about this film. A couple movies in this month. Coming up in April, I'll be reviewing some films, so might be some spoilers on a couple films because I have to really explain about this. If I don't explain it without not trying to spoil, but this film... I had to, I had to give a spoiler warning. Oops. So yeah, that is somewhere. See this film, fantastic movie. Yeah, so that is my review of somewhere. Come back next time, I'll have another review. Take care.